Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. So, if you've ever wanted to rig a car, you know it comes with a couple of obstacles. First, you need a 3D model, then you need to go learn rigging or use an add-on to rig this. And, you know, hopefully those things get to work. But today we have exciting news coming from the guys at Blender Now, creators of the transportation add-on. Now, the beautiful thing with the version 2 that was just released is the fact that all of the cars that you get with the transportation add-on comes pre-rigged and you can simply start animating all of the cars even without having any technical know-how of how to even do any form of rigging so if you want to get this link is going to be in the description where you can check it out meanwhile there is a 10 percent coupon code that you can use to get this add-on and this is valid from now till the 15th of november 2020 so without further ado let's dive over to blender and take a look at how this actually works so with blender simply open right here once you download this tool go over to edit go over to preference and you do all of that installation stuff next thing which we're going to do let's take this cube out next thing which you're going to do is press n on the keyboard and you notice you have your transportation add-on right here click on the transportation add-on select whatever car you want so let's simply say maybe we want the lamborghini why not and click on add vehicle now once you add the vehicle it appears on your viewport the next thing you have to do is just click on make a detable for animation and that is how easy it is for you to get a model and get it fully available for animation it is rigged and you can do everything you want now how do you animate this it's as simple as that select the rig controllers go all the way from here change this from object to pose mode and that's it really simple select the object select any of your manipulators and you have this isn't this so cool all right this is really nice so depending on how you want your car to bounce however you want to animate this yes you can and it even gets interesting because if you're looking for suspension you're looking for spring yep you have that for all of the wheels and then it gets even crazier because you can simply select this and move this all the way back in traditional mode you want this to move and you want the wheels to happen yep that happens so once you move the car you can also notice that the wheels simply move what about swaveling what if you want to swap let's say you want to move side to side yes you can do that so you can see the wheels are also so respectful that they are in place and you know this is just beautiful you can go back and do all of those beautiful things you regularly do with the transportation add-on like snapping to ground changing the material however you want using custom materials putting some hdris let's actually add one right now putting some hdris playing with how you want the hdris to work adding a back plate putting a transparent background and all of these things are all packed in one atom this is a good one this is a worthy one that you should definitely take a look at all right so you've seen the first one and you're like whoa this is so cool what's powering this how does it work and how can i animate with this stuff i'm actually going to blow your mind away because the next thing which we're going to talk about is even way interesting so the tool powering the rigging for the transportation add-on is known as rig a car now this is a free add-on that you can get on github so if you go over to github you can simply download this one totally for free and that is the tool set that is powering all of the four wheeled vehicles that you get directly here with the transportation add-on and let's actually make things fun what if you want to animate across the terrain now that comes with extra effort because you have to respect several you know depths of the terrain maybe several heights and stuff but this is very it's very interesting because right now you can select any object in your scene go over to our modifiers and let's simply add an ocean modifier to this with the ocean modifier i'm going to set the depth to zero and maybe just turn this down a little bit next thing which i'll do is just apply this because we can now i'm also going to move this to a certain point like so so let's do that one right there and press n on the keyboard launch the bad boy transportation add-on and you know with the transportation add-on you have a long list of cars that you can use so you want something urban all right so you get some urban stuff you want something sexy you can get some sedan if you also want something that is just classic you know you just like classic cars yeah you can get these ones as well now depending on anything that you want you can simply select these things and you can get up and running with it let's take some spots for example so we have the spot sets of cars and i would like to get a jaguar let's add that jaguar to our scene very easy and then we can also make it a detable for animation if you want to snap this to ground of course you can click on snap vehicle to ground and it snaps that to ground 
and we can also make this editable for animation. Now, where it gets even way interesting is instead of manually animating all of this, you want to animate this instead of manually animating all of this, you can simply select the rig or the rig controllers, go over to rig a car, which is actually a free add-on. And if you want to bake like the car steering, you want to bake all this, of course you can do that. But let's talk about the ground sensor. So you can now use the eyedropper and select the ground. So you can select for all of the car tires. And once you're done with that, we can simply move this car to any point and you can see that happening in real time all right so let's actually take a closer look and see what we have here so if you want to animate this of course you can so you can simply animate this across this let's select our terrain and let's tap s on the keyboard and also tap y just to scale this a little bit more and next thing which we may want to do is simply animate this all the way from one point to another i'm also going to turn on auto keyframe so let's position this one right here turn on the auto keyframe and let's get that one right over to a point like that raise this all the way up set this to 120 and push this right to a point like that and that is how easy it is for you to get things going and that is how simple it is for you to actually get any car that you have with the transportation add-on rigged and ready for anything that you want you want to create a loop of course you can do that let's make that 120 bounce this all the way back and you can choose to throw in several things you can choose to throw in a camera you can choose to throw in some you know movement depending on what you want and this has never been easier and one thing to note is only four wheel vehicles are rigged now if you're trying to get maybe your motorcycle your bicycle or maybe the boats to be animated those ones are not rigged yet of course these are things that are going to be happening over time as the developer has also promised that he's going to make some very cool changes to this and yes if you want to get this tool i think this is a good time to get it since it's 10 percent off and you can save up a couple of bucks by just simply getting this and of course you're not saving just the money but then you're saving time for creating these cars time for rigging them and also time for having them to be animated and you want to see a long list of things that are rigged and things that are new and things that are you know available for you you can simply come over to the link in the description and take a look at all of this a tool set that gives you all of these tools and gives you all of these utilities for you to create stuff is just simply impressive and yes this is definitely about it you want to make some drift you want to make suspension you want to lift the front up you want to bounce it back you want to play with the steering ground dictation and acceleration all of these things are within your back and call as you can simply achieve so much by using an add-on like this so this is definitely going to be about it if you want to see more videos about the transportation link is going to be in the description you want to grab this tool you want to grab the free one as well link is also going to be in the description so you can do well to check these things out tell me what you guys think about this in the comment section and of course if you like this video or you learned something from it you can go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend and if you're new here it's going to be amazing for you to hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until i see you guys again the tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace